Hi, I'm Esther Jones and I've been working as a hypnobirthing practitioner since 2007. And I'm also a mother of three. And I really learned the power of affirmations when I was pregnant with my second child. So I was really determined that this birth wouldn't be hard and painful like my first labor. And that this time my mind and body wouldn't be tense and resistant. And so I prepared for his birth with hypnobirthing and a key part of that preparation was using these really simple affirmations. And I'm going to read them out loud in a moment, but first of all, I'd like to just explain why affirmations, which are so simple, are also so powerful. So remember that whatever is in our minds in childbirth will determine how our body responds to labor. So anxious, fearful thoughts create tension in the body and tension in the body creates pain. So unfortunately, human beings have a tendency to really fixate on the negative. And this negative bias is also how we keep ourselves safe. So we remember much more clearly the bad things that we hear about or that we experience so that we'll know what to avoid in the future. In the case of childbirth, the messages around pain and danger are really um, uh, very intense. And so these negative thoughts around childbirth tend to really be entrenched in our minds and they create these habitual patterns of thought around labor that sometimes we're not even conscious of. And sometimes they pop up in our internal dialogues or in our self-talk. And other times we barely notice the thought, but we might feel some sense of dread or worry in the body. So what affirmations do is they really challenge these old thoughts by replacing them with new positive thoughts. And the more that we use these affirmations, the more deeply we'll take these new thoughts, new feelings on until they finally become our new habitual way of thinking. So how can we use the affirmations successfully? Well, I would recommend saying them out loud every morning and you can use the ones that I'm going to use now here, or you could create some of your own that you think will be uh, most useful to you that really speak to something uh, that worries you. So at the beginning, you may notice some resistance in your body as you say things that you don't quite believe yet. But as the days go by and the weeks go by, you're going to find yourself saying them with more conviction and believing in them. And so um, another thing I did was to print the affirmations out and I would carry them around with me. And whenever I felt a twinge of worry or of doubt, then I would just take them out, read through them. And that was always enough to just get my mind back to where I needed it. They were just enough to really reassure me and to stop my thoughts spiraling to somewhere fearful or disempowering. So you may well also find that there are one or two affirmations that really resonate particularly uh, deeply with you. And in that case, hold those ones close. Um, I often hear from women that I've worked with who found themselves um, using one specific affirmation during labor uh, almost as a mantra, and they didn't realize until they went into labor how, how that would work for them. So very simple, but very, very effective. Um, so I'm going to read the affirmations out now. So you might want to stop the video now and just get into a relaxed, comfortable position. And now I'm going to invite you to close your eyes softly, to take a moment to relax your face. So all the little muscles around your eyes, your forehead, cheeks and jaw. Now take in a slow breath through the nose, breathing in relaxation, and then breathing out through the nose, imagining that breath flowing all the way down through your body to the soles of your feet. Breathing out any stress or tension, just feeling it all melt away. And breathing in again, and as you breathe out this time, feel your shoulders sinking into the frame of your body. And now just continuing to breathe normally and slowly as I read out the birthing affirmations. My body is perfectly designed to give birth. I am able to quickly enter a deep state of relaxation. As my mind relaxes, my body relaxes. I feel confident, I feel safe, I feel secure. I trust my body to know what to do. My muscles work in complete harmony during each surge. 
I allow myself to flow with the rhythm of my body. I relax more deeply as the surges become more powerful. I feel the power of my uterus and relax in the knowledge that my body is in control. With each surge, my body softens and opens. I am prepared to meet whatever turn my birthing takes. I meet each surge only with my breath. My body is at ease. My cervix opens and allows my baby to ease down. I fully relax and turn my birthing over to nature. I embrace the power of my body as each surge brings my baby closer. And I see myself holding my baby in my arms. And now, whenever you're ready, just opening your eyes and coming back to the room. I hope you're feeling lovely and relaxed. And if you've enjoyed this video, please join me for the next one. And do share any thoughts or questions in the comments below. And also you can join me for a free live hypnobirthing relaxation session every Thursday. And you'll find the details below.